<laughs> yeah, <laughs> like, what's going on? Just take some meditate, no. me meditate, you should meditate. Mm -hmm. Just have a bath or something, I don't know. <laughs> don't take a walk. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get some of those scented candles or some shit. Did you just say to walk it off? Walk it off. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, walk it off, captive. <laughs> walk, walk, walk off snort? being restrained. I think you know, it. That would be a good idea. You, you are infecting! You are infecting all of us! I know! I'm like, that's why you don't deserve inspiration. <gasps> no! <laughs> uh, crash, real quick. Yes. Did yes. the other captives say this, or did like my brother say this? The other captives. Okay. Your ca yeah, the other guys. So, so you guys arrive at towards the edge of the slums next to a river. The vacant. And, uh, the vacant uh, gap lot, whatever you wish to call it, where a water wheel would have been, you now see a broken defunct one. Blair looks around the premises and crouches down, and you guys, <laughs> you guys hear rather peculiarly her sniff the air very deeply. She's here. You paid for it. Okay, just like silently judges Anushka for not being such a swag ranger. Hmm? <laughs> 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 Blair is like location well, under double level. It's me? No. No. She just points at the building ahead. She's in there. Are you able to tell where more precisely in the building? Up, down, south. I'm afraid not. I'm not that good yet. You and I still got a lot to learn. I'm just familiar with this type of situation. The Lord Seeker. I'm through with him. Who has a plan how to engage this? If we can determine where she is, I can get in and out in 12 seconds. Okay, um, can all of you that are not participating in the planning, roll me perception. 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 That's good. 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 21, but then you all got plus two. What the fuck is with these guidances? Everyone's in. I don't know, man. That's just weird. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Sorry, the three of that. you notice it. It comes and goes like a UFO light in the distance. What's a UFO? Uh, every now and again, the I glimpse of red light. Mm. The glimpse of red light through the cracks, the thin, small cracks and seams of the wall. No particular pattern to them. Let's also walk over to it and look at it closer. You walk all the way to the building. Nope. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> I, I said know. you're seeing it, it. It's in the building and you're seeing it through the wall, through the cracks in the wall. If you want to walk up to the building, be my guess. How far is it? Does it From the edge of the slums, this water wheel, this like, uh, what's, what's it called? Mm -hmm. a, a, a water mill, rather. It's probably some 90 feet away from the edge, the edgemost house of the slums. It's honestly on a bit of a slope, <laughs> dipping down to the point where you wonder, maybe given a couple more years or some erosion or a heavy storm or something, maybe <laughs> the whole fucking thing will landslide off the edge. But as of right now, it's it's stable. So I can go look at the cracks that I see something through, right? If you go up to the walls, yeah. Is the is the red light look like it's yeah. moving like a long yes. thing? Like maybe pacing or something? It doesn't have any pattern to it now. Uh, it, do, it does linger predominantly on the right side of the building. 
in the terms of like how many uh, occurrences and frequencies you guys see from it. Here, I'll, I'll do like a really shit map right now. Hold on. Yeah. <laughs> Hmm. The way that it keeps uh, asking makes me nervous, but I'm gonna stick to it so I can just go look at it. Yeah, yeah. I wonder if it's like coming from a person. So if it goes higher than that, then obviously not. But so here you, uh, here we go. So there is a river that runs nearby because that's how water wheels work. What? Yeah. <laughs> I know, it's insane. It's so fucking wild that water wheels need water? Oh my god. Oh my god, that makes so much sense. I was I wondering why they're all wet. Anyways, <laughs> um, <laughs> moving on past the Valley Fringe. Uh, the building itself occupied... Oh, that's way too bad line. Uh, the building... Maybe this needs to be a different color, actually. The building itself occupies a little bit on the water's edge, because that's how water wheels work. <gasps> Uh, I'm gonna draw not the room plan because obviously you guys don't have the room plan. I'm gonna draw the perimeter of the building itself. <laughs> and then you guys will be situated like over here. Here's here's a here's a building and here's a here's a building. Here's a building. <laughs> here's a here's a triangle building. I don't know why someone just built out of scraps. His uh, best, okay. <laughs> he's trying to. Yeah, you're right. You're right. Uh, it's sixty feet away. I lied. <laughs> I lied. It's sixty feet away. So yeah, you guys are all assembled over here. Uh, assembled over here. Silas is the collective all. <laughs> you guys go fucking drop ourselves around. Down there. I'm just saying. I did it first. I did it. Double D, double die. Double D, double die. Yes, I'll start to walk towards there. Do you sneak up there or do you walk up? I'll sneak up there. Romeo, you're so stealth. We're trying to figure out how to like Her. best approach to the situation where it could very easily. Yeah, and then and then and then Silas just goes really goes just walks over there. Um, the cat is dead. Not very. Well, if we come from this angle, we might be less visible. Where the where the fuck's he at? <laughs> <laughs> you can see and hear me, apparently, because I got 11. <laughs> apparently. Beat! Your brother is talking to you. He's telling you how things are different. How your parents were found out for being rebels and got their just desserts. How you and him can make things right. <laughs> And then his ear perks for a moment, and he looks over his shoulder, his blood magic readied. He looks at the wall nearby. I suppose they weren't lying then. Your friends are fast. Yeah, um, I can rely on them. You're really, you're really not coming back with me, are you? Things were so different back then. Um, I wasn't thinking clearly, and I didn't know better and paid the price for it. I was uh, brainwashed. And I thought that the nobles were people to be worshipped, but that's far from the truth. What our noble did to our parents, it's unforgivable. I'm just gonna roll something real fast. <laughs> oh, okay, I was gonna. He takes a deep breath when you say all that. <laughs> you're right, Deed, you're right. They're not people, they're not gods to be worshipped, but. They have a plan. What? They, they know what they're doing. What are you talking about? I can't tell you. Not unless you come back with me. It's not going to happen. 
you ta- you have to tell me for the sake of our people. He crouches down and puts his hands on your shoulders. Deet. That's why you need to come back. For our people. We're gonna get our place in this world. Oh, that that can't be. How can you trust? How can you trust him after what you've done? The same way I can trust a snake to lunge and strike and bite. The same way I could trust a scorpion to sting. And a bird to fly. That's how. You you yourself now, with your good passive perception, could hear the sounds of crunching steps outside <laughs> the wall. <laughs> Silas, you could hear conversation inside the wall. Whoa. What? I'm listening, thinking that I'm sneaking so well that they do me. <laughs> I won't force you this time. Deet. He stands up and he begins casting a mystical incantation. <laughs> the ground beneath his feet becomes this chasm of blood. You can hear elven whispers coming out of it, whispering to you. And then he just says, I'll be seeing you, sister. I'll be seeing you. And then he plunges down the hole in the ground. And it closes back up. Um, he's just in shock. I'm trying to process. those of you that observe the red light, tis no longer there after it became bright for a particularly you know, good amount of time, approximately six seconds. Silas, you heard all that, by the way. Yeah, I was going to say, can I like tell that it's Dee's voice? <laughs> and then uh, could I hear what they were saying? Yeah, totally. Okay. So you're probably around over here. No, but... Get rid of this massive... Get the get shit out of here. Get out of here. So over there. <laughs> and you're probably over here. Maybe nice. I'm over there. I can make a really dumb decision right now. But I'm not going mm-hmm. to. I could. But I'm not gonna. Maybe have to look at this thing. Oh. So meanwhile, to those of you guys in the back, <laughs> over, over here, planning maybe. I don't know anymore. So I guess we're just walking over there. Yeah, you guys saw Silas walk, walk all the way, <laughs> close the 60 foot distance all the way up, and no one shot them or anything, so, <laughs> that. I mean, either yeah. Deed is dead well, or he's completely safe at this point, so. Shall we? I think the element of surprise is gone. Would I be nice to hear them outside? If they're talking out loud like this, yes. Hmm? <laughs> Where, where's, like, the front door to this place? Yeah, where's the door? <laughs> Do we see one? Oh, that's that's so funny that you guys you guys think that a door is going to be used in this instance. <laughs> that's that's so very funny. Yep. And, and I gives all an inspiration. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Yeah, I was gonna say yeah. So, anyways, Zol breaks through the wall. <laughs> I like that he just turns red. <laughs> oh my god! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> So he literally walks up in a silent rage. Ooh. And he gets up to behind you, Slaz, as you're like waiting for everyone to close distance. He's he has a faster movement speed than most of you except Oriana. <laughs> he just walks up with his axe in hand. He's like all, he has a lot of extra hair on his body at current. And he just <laughs> says he, he just walks over to you in front of you, Slaz, and says Is she on the other side? Says so nods. Move. <laughs> they do so. <laughs> he just walks up, cracks his neck once, takes the axe in both his hands, and <gasps> just breaks and cleaves right through the building. To be fair, it's old, decrepit wood, 
but he makes a. Br if you guys ever play C, just like seeing Sledge hit a wall. It makes no sense, but he does it anyways. And he just walks through the debris. A piece falls off that's like dangling from the force and it breaks down and stabs into his neck like a little bunch of those splinters. Just He doesn't even notice it. He just looks and scans around slowly. And sees Dean. And he walks over. And throws his axe to the down, goes over the chains and just pulls them apart. Just Getting you out of here. Oh, thank you so much. And then, um, go on. The uh, hugs all. Zol makes a constitution save. <laughs> <laughs> Zol fails a constitution save. <laughs> oh my god. What's gonna do? Pass out. <laughs> He, you hug onto him, but he doesn't hug you back, and he just sort of takes your arms off from around him and like, puts you aside. We need to go. Deep, roam your insight. I'll do an advantage. Oh, uh, just, roll, just roll one more time straight. That's fine. You do get your guidance now, funnily enough. So nice. Oh my god. Nice. Oh my god. Nice. That's, That's a shame. That is trash. That's so uh. sad. <laughs> Did you have an inspiration? <laughs> <laughs> we got flex on curse here. Can I just roll like a Marshall die? I hate you all. Not a thing. <laughs> <laughs> if you don't, then you don't. Oh no, I don't. Shame. Which... Shut up, Kirsty. <laughs> I know we're targeting the bully, but shut up! <laughs> <laughs> Zol seems out of it. Uncharacteristically so. I'll give you that. As you guys are, you know, Zol pushes, not pushes, he gently ushers you aside. He sort of was like at your back as you're leaving, <laughs> stepping through the broken wooden debris. Looking at the doors that, uh, the, rather, the one door that leads into this place. Mission accomplished. You guys have acquired the hostage. The hostage, Easy. Is, <laughs> the hostage, hostage is secured. Recovery of my life. Hmm? Yeah, fucking easy. How many have you had? Easiest mission we've done to date. GG. Ease. Assassins, e. GTEs. Let's ignore that we went for the gun. Did, did we get a bag? Back? Is that bag here? Person. Oh yeah, yeah. two different people were looking for that fucking bag. The bag is not here, I'm afraid. As you guys begin rant, and my bad, investigating the building, no, <laughs> right, exactly. looking, looking for ye old and bag of holding. You do not find it. Why do you say like that? Um. I don't know. I thought it was, that might be funny. Any red light in the area? Other than the blood, Zol is still seeing no. <laughs> <Gotcha>. <laughs> All right, yeah, we did have noticed the red light. If it's inside the building. I mean, of course she did. It's her brother's arms, after all. Yeah. yeah that was the bit the whole time. Is that the red light was him? Yeah. Were you saying uh, something just now, Dorky? I didn't mean to cut you off. Deet just um, explains uh, about the red light and how um, there are other people here. It's most likely he's taken the bags. Hmm. Do you know where they <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> No, I was gonna, I was gonna say no. I'm stupid. No, say it. <laughs> he was gonna be like, can, can you describe any of the people? Did you recognize any of them? <laughs> Were you familiar yes. with any of them? Know any uh, of their names? Well, not the location at the current moment. I think mm -hmm. that would be very telling. What do you tell them? Deep. Um. I. 
I haven't told you guys the full story of my background. Ah. Uh, you haven't told me half the story. I think this is for them. I'm just gonna step away. <laughs> <laughs> no better time than the present. Yeah. As Alessandra, you begin like take a step aside. Kasai does come on up because she did come with you guys and just sort of like grab you or ah, grab you put her hand <laughs> on the back of your shoulder and just sort of like usher you forward like leaning you she is still a bit under the effect of drug influence so she is slightly leaning her weight on you oh i agree with kasai you're part of this now like it or not all right so get back in here she she does chuckle <laughs> when you say ow <laughs> <laughs> Do you have to do that every time? Now I feel obligated. But he'll, <laughs> he's a, he'll walk back. Stay he's a new shot. provincial. <laughs> he's sensitive. <laughs> he's a weak little baby man. You see Amber eyeing Kasai like... Like, what the fuck? <laughs> but that's about it. So! What do you tell him, D? Or... Or it's, a, or it's around 5.50 p.m. PST. Mm. <laughs> I think that's good. Quit in time. Leave, leave it till next session. We could leave it in next session. That's a good idea, dorky. We're going to do that. Sounds like you volunteered to open next session. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that thing I told you about, dorky, you don't have to do it. Let it be known. You don't have to. I don't want to pitch it to you. Same way I pitch it to Ninot. Tell, yeah. uh, what, what's the term? Ah. Get your chickens in order or some shit like that? Get your chickens in a line? I don't know what the fucking expression is. Get line yourself sorted. your chickens, dude. <laughs> Thank you, Fish Alec. in a barrel. I made that up. That's not oh. how it is. <laughs> it's <laughs> analogy is it is meant for you as a player to get yourself sorted. Are you as talking I said. about getting your ducks in a row? Thank you! Put Thank your you chickens all. in the same basket. <laughs> <laughs> You Thank you all. Long. Get your ducks in a row. Uh, Cock. But you don't have to do it if you think your ducks are already in a row. But yeah. it's up to you. I know you're busy. You yeah. Um. Can I get back to you on that? Certainly. Awesome. So, we wrap up today's session with you guys leaving the slums. <laughs> can Alexander and Silas roll me your perception? Oh, absolutely. Do you want? <laughs> I know, I've already taken so much from you. Yo! <laughs> I, I understand and accept any little hate you throw at me, Alec. Like, I understand. <laughs> not, for, not for nothing, though, but my fucking. My skill checks have been pretty damn good this whole session. <laughs> nice. Alessander and Silas, as you guys are all walking back through the slums, Silas. There is no music. Alexander. <laughs> I just didn't tell you about the music in the first place the first time, but there is no music. Nope. <laughs> and you know uh -huh. that you ain't hearing no harmonica in the streets. I, mean, I think he... Uh, these three perceptions, uh, the 25, 21, and 21... Was that? No, I forget what those were. No, those, so. a, uh, those were for uh, the red light. Yeah, the red light. Right, right. Before that was... The one before that was general perception, and um, as you guys were trekking to the slums. Mm. Okay, yeah, so that was the one where I heard the music. Oh my god, the assassins killed the little boy out of spite. <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna say, can someone look around? See, they probably won't, they don't expect you. They kept the bag and shoved the child in the bag. Um, <laughs> um, are you trained on harmonica? I'm not trained on harmonica. Okay, that's fine. Actually, I might be. Hold on, let me check. I might be. No, it's big pipes. That's the other okay, one. Okay, okay, that's fine, buddy. Just roll me your uh, performance then. Um, do you ask Alexander to come with you? Yeah. Does Alexander come with? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> then you can roll with advantage then. As the two mm -hmm. of you split off from the group to go locate the soundless music, so to speak. Mm -hmm. Okay, roll. Oh. It's a 14, it's pretty good. It's okay. With my proficiency. It's not bad. It's alright. 
You find a crying child. Oh no! Shoot it! <laughs> Shoot it! <laughs> Shoot it! <laughs> man, man, daycares would be a lot different uh, if that was the case. You find the same child you guys saw before. Sans, their old man, crying. Sans. Just shut the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> Sans, the old man. Sans. Sans. <laughs> Sans. This is all under tail, dumbass. So he's crying and alone. He's crying and alone. And he's like standing <laughs> off the sir. porch. Uh, he's like looking around and like tears are streaming down from his eyes as he's looking around frantically. And then he sees you guys. And he gets like this like, ha! Ah! Like, like look of hope on his face. And he like runs over to you. Uh, and I'm, I'm now going to roll for comedic slash tragic effect. I see. Nice! It's a sign! <laughs> nice! He, he falls down and eats shit. No! As, as he hurriedly rushes over to you, he trips on a shoelace and fucking falls over and falls flat on his fucking face. <laughs> How Can close is he to us? Him, He's like 10, 15 feet ahead of you guys. Hmm. He's like, it's you get off. Just kidding, he doesn't swear. <laughs> oh, wait, uh, he, he moves within, uh, <laughs> what? What? moves within my upper, opportunity attack range. <laughs> I'm not going to do anything with the information, I just, I just want everyone to know that. Can I that I'm smack actually him? choosing to not shoot the child. No, I totally can. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> so he falls over and starts fucking crying even harder. Yeah, he starts uh, crying even harder, as children often do. Alexander will look over at Silas and like now. gesture to him, like go. go. Shut the fuck up! You don't even have to. Silas already running over. <laughs> He's like sitting up and crying, bawling. Silas <laughs> so will crouch near him. <laughs> I'm not gonna do cry voice because it's because it would probably be too unintelligible to accurately do a child's voice as trying to cry, uh, speak. Yeah. Yeah, please don't. Yeah. Do 